we got a new jailbreak update. So today I am going to show you what's new. Before we start, um, make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel. I appreciate it a bunch. First, we've got this, you know, this new um, GUI for the level system. So this is like, um, let me think, one, two, three, four. This is like version four of the level UI. And you can see the um, mission button is here and not over here. You can see there's the bonus reward. You can see here's all the prizes, the contracts, and we collect a bounty of 4,000 without dying. So. This is going to be, um, this is going to be a little bit harder. Um, also, the Rob the Tomb four times is also going to be a lot harder. Um, arrest 15 criminals and use road spikes to pop three tires. So they really redid the, um, the, you know, the contracts. Um, right, right now I can't get season pass right now because I'm in the process of exchanging and I am in the process of saving up right now, so I will get the season pass later on. I will make a video on it to demonstrate. So we can see you can gift right here, criminals and police. Uh, let's get into the what's new. So if you look over here, there's this new maximum security prison. So if we go and go on and do our like this and see there's this there's this police officer with his donuts and there's a pistol right here and see this is like another elevator right here and look at these lasers this is going to be a bit challenging i'm not going to lie so you can see there's all these lasers right here um there's also this stairway over here and like this goes all the way to the main prison so let's see if we can actually go down there. Let's let's see if we can go down there. Okay, so here is where you can enter. So there's the stairway I mentioned earlier, and we can go here and uh, just watch out for these lakes because they can hurt. We go. See, look, just jump, jump. That's just lasers are moving so fast; it can be quite challenging, though. So yeah, I just literally went oof right there. So yeah, that's what it looks like. Uh, let's see, let's go to and look, explore the new cars. So I just noticed the prison bus no longer spawns over here. It now spawns right where the car used to spawn from October of 2020 all the way to, um, I think somewhere where the prison was changed. So yeah, it now spawns right here and you no longer need to hijack. Just quite uh, a simo. Um, that sus right there. That, the prison box. This is uh, the season place right here. See, season 17. Uh, it's going to show up. It's, it's going to last for about 60 days. It's probably higher than usual. And here's the new car up here that you cannot purchase right now because. You know, everybody just started the season. So first, we can go ahead, go here. We can, there's 181 XP to get to level two. So we go this way. This is, um, see where the new car spawns, uh, the other mission. So the new car spawns right here, the you know where the snake used to be. I got about 21 million and 220, and I'm gonna be broke after this update. So, well, just for this. So, one like is one ripped 900k or an 890k. So it says seven days only. Three, two, one, boom. This is the car right here. It's this wow. It's 
like insanely fast. Yeah, I might. I, this might be a really high value car because of how fast it is. Um, but you know, we can't trade. You can't get trade back to this car because you know this car just came out and you know, everybody's like, purchase it, purchase it, purchase it, and you know, it might go broke, but they'll get a lot of profits for this car. For a lot of the OGs. So I noticed in the garage, um, the words, some of the retired vehicles that are in the garage are actually, are actually spawnable. Uh, well, at the most part, it's not at least spawnable, it's just that it requires level 10 for this. So does that mean we, we can get these old, older seasonal cars? Well, we'll have to see. So, so all these cars say you need level 10 for this, which it kind of confuses me because why would a SEMO actually do that? Um, well, one, I could probably tell why they could have done this, maybe because they wanted more players to have it, but you can see it shows all of the retired vehicles in this one um, garage, you know, you don't have some clicking all and stuff will not actually change it. So they've done something interesting about the, the garage. Customize it. See the customizations have feature right here. And it gives all the stuff. So feature, it actually looks a little laid out like the like the old um, garage that we had um, some time ago. So it's features, it says we set some five days horns, there's our, with our horns right here, and I forgot about the tail lights being like spiky like that, kind of interesting, and the greatest thing is, um, the best thing is that um, it no longer, yeah, now nah, I think I'm, It just has feature right there instead of texture, which can be a little bit annoying because I would want the, I would want the textures to be first. But yeah, that's what that's what it's uh, I'm, that's what it's supposed to be. Um, still, I've not seen any um, of these retired Beagle stripes be ret returned yet. Like the Bugatti, the Mini Cooper. The Mini Cooper has old, the old stripes. It doesn't have the stripe, the retired stripes. But all, the, but these don't have the stripes. Does that mean? And when I reach level ten, do we get torpedo? The garage text it's now displayed here instead of in the middle right here and the text is white